To the delight of residents, a giant clump of mushrooms has appeared in the Kakadu Lake Recreation Reserve near Narracourt, South Australia. Highlights big buns are often seen in grassy areas near native trees. Large buns are often seen in grassy areas near native trees. An ecologist says there have been reports that eating donuts can cause gastrointestinal issues. The fungus is believed to be the large boletus, Phlebopus marginatus, which is not widely reported in regional South Australia. Boletes are considered Australia's largest terrestrial fungus and usually appear in autumn after drenching rains. Pad the way resident Luke Leddy came across gorgeous mushrooms while hiking on a reserve. It's the first time I've seen the big ones. There are at least six of them, Leddy said. While giant mushrooms have been spotted in the southeast over the years, he said it's great to see these mushrooms, given their size. I didn't know much about them until I went home and saw them and googled them. They can grow up to a meter, Leddy said. These mushrooms originated in the Kakadu Lake Recreation Reserve near Narracourt. Mr. Leddy visits Kakadu Lake weekly to look for birds to photograph, and he had never seen these mushrooms before. I wondered why they appeared. I researched and found out that this large bullet can be found any time of the year after a soaking rain, he said. They are often found in eucalyptus forests, well as grassy expanses such sport ovals and parks. When I first saw them, I thought they were a pile of wood left by the campers. A baby takes nap on a giant mushroom in grassland on limestone beach. He said his son noticed first and shouted these are mushrooms. We often look for mushrooms in Pad the Way Conservation Park, so he was very excited, Leddy said. These were very impressive in size and different from what we usually find. Their undersides are spongy rather than gills. He said some of the mushrooms were at least 40 centimeters wide. Edibility warning ecologist, author and environmental photographer Alison Puglio said the mushrooms Leddy found were Phlebopus marginatus. They typically appear in the fall, he said, when the soil temperature cools and moisture levels increase. There have been more reports of Phlebopus marginatus in Victoria than in SA. There aren't many records for their distribution in South Australia, but that probably doesn't mean they are rarely recorded, it's probably unrecorded, he said. Ms. Puglio said there are different opinions about whether these mushrooms can be eaten. Some people report eating them, while others report gastrointestinal symptoms after eating them. Ms. Puglio is one of the authors of a guide for hunter-gatherers called Growing Wild Mushrooms. According to the Living Atlas of Australia, Phlebopus marginatus is typically found in the forests of southeast and southwest Australia. One specimen found in Victoria was reported to weigh 29 kilos.